Yo, what is up YouTube? It's your boy Technicolor Concepts here coming at you with another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. And today we are going to cover a quick, simple little money glitch. Some of you may have seen other videos posted about this particular glitch, but as I just had an update here just a day or so ago, it still works. So I was kind of surprised and thought I would share it with everybody. If you do not recognize the house we are at, it is the Van Horn Mansion. It's right here. It's this square inside the oval, just underneath the Van Horn Trading Post. Far east side of the map. Between Saint Denis and Ansburg, right up here. where we are now if you've not been to this location I'm actually in chapter 3 so I kind of took it upon myself to just come out here but if you've not gotten to this place yet you, there's a few things in the house to check out a few things on the outside of the house to check out once you've done the glitch, none of these things will come back except for the money. And the money is down these little stairs. As soon as you walk in the door, you hang a right, you come down these stairs. I would be careful and quiet, however, because there are two dipshits snoozing away down here. And as you can see right there, is money laying on the table make quick work of these guys and that's all you gotta do by all means feel free to loot their bodies you would normally get something there's 48 cents and some revolver rounds and some bitters so that's always good having extra supplies is always a good thing You'll get different stuff every time you loot these bodies. There's some horse medicine, that's always going to get apparently. But the main thing we are after is the money here on the table. Granted, it is not a lot of money, it is only $50. But you can repeat this particular glitch over and over and over and over again as many times as you see fit. And you don't have to sell anything, you don't have to go to the fence, you don't have to do anything. You just go downstairs, kill a couple dudes, take the money off the table. And once you have taken the money, all you have to do is just save the game. As you see, I have $3,584.28 after picking up the $50. Hit pause, go down to story save game you can save this anywhere you want to it doesn't really matter it's done saving back up go to load load that last save that you just made when this company is done loading you should respawn pretty close to the house might be right in front of it, you might be down the road just a little bit, who knows, but you should be within walking or running distance to the house, you won't be very far. And then all you gotta do is go in and do the same thing you just did, kill the guys, take the money, save it and load it, it's that easy. couple of times just so you can see that it does work the money does keep adding up and like I said you can do this as many times as you want and you never have to go and sell anything other than the stuff that you get off of the bodies which just adds more to it so it's a win-win if you ask me 
basically right in front, well, the horse is right in front of the house, we are up right here a little further away. So I'm actually going to jump on the horse. I was not that far from the house. So, any, wherever it respawns you, you won't be very far from the house. And you can just simply keep going back and forth and back and forth. The main thing is just don't take the money without killing these guys first. Otherwise, you will wake them up. Now, if you wake them up with a stick of dynamite, that's totally fine. But if you try to take the money off the table before you kill these guys, they will wake up, they will start shooting at you, and it's a good possibility that their shooting could get somebody else's attention. I have had that happen before. As you see, 35.85. Take the 50 bucks. Now we're at 36.35. When I load this back up, save it and load it back up, you'll see that I found the same amount. Save it. Back up, go to load, load that safe. Here we are, back in front of the house. And you see, 36.35. That's what it was after I took that last $50. Go in, it's just gonna add another $50 to that. $6.35 is what we got. I'm gonna add $50 to that. So now we're up to $36.85. And just like that, folks, it is that simple. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up, hit that like button, leave a comment, share it with your friends, and as always, I appreciate it. Hope to see you next time.